Norwalk is going green and clean. Live Green Connecticut kicked off its fifth annual free weekend event at Taylor Farm on Calf Pasture Beach Road on Saturday. We've got the health and wellness section, we have a pet section, we have a great um, eco-friendly car section. Every year, the statewide family fun event brings together eco-friendly and energy efficient vendors from all over Connecticut. This year's event hosted over 150 exhibitors and comes in great timing for the city. We have the largest private fleet of all electric trucks in North America. We have about uh, almost 400 electric vehicles on the road. Earlier this year, Mayor Harry Rilling formed Norwalk's first energy and environment task force. It also marks the first year the city has participated in an energy challenge. The Norwalk Energy Challenge started a couple months ago and we've had so many people participate in it and a portion of every home energy assessment, every audit, a portion of that assessment fee goes towards the, um, the Norwalk Energy and Environment Task Force. So far the challenge has raised $1,500 to be given to the task force to fund green energy projects. Children had the chance to get up close to farm and wildlife animals and take a ride on a solar-powered carousel. Adults geared up to test drive electric bicycles from Bloomfield's bike and wind down with a massage from Norwalk Hospital's Holistic Health Initiative. We're promoting our integrative medicine program, which is wonderful um, for the whole community, not just patients of our cancer center. Um, we offer Reiki and massage therapy and acupuncture. And um, it's just a way um, for people to relieve stress and promote healing. The event also brought to the green a replica of the 1901 Gustav Whitehead, the first recorded airplane in flight. This looked like a big hang glider with a boat hanging underneath it. A man actually did fly an airplane before the Wright brothers, and somehow he got lost and never got credit. The Live Green Connecticut event continues tomorrow, September 14th, from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. In Norwalk, I'm Priscilla Lombardi for its relevant news.